we're going to modify some rubber bushings today. Um, they're not urethane. Urethane's fairly easy to turn, actually. So, uh, what it is, is these are the tension control rod mounts. And so, uh, I use more or less uh, sway bar bushings. Okay. And, you know, this is a poor example. I thought I had a new one here. This is a slightly abused one, but uh, the little uh, nipple sticking out on the end here. Okay, that is so that when you put it together, it it registers there, and then when the uh, the shaft of the TC rod goes in there, it's actually held in there and protected. Uh, the the new bushings I got, I I ordered like ten sets at one time from Rock Auto, and one of the drawbacks to Rock Auto is since it's all excess and surplus stuff for the most part when you're getting the cheap stuff. Uh, I got some kits that had nipples. And a bunch of kits that didn't. And I don't really want to... They were like three, four bucks a set. So no big deal on the cost. But I don't really want to order new ones. So I'm going to put nipples on here. They're the same height there. Okay. I just need to put a nipple on it. Because the thing is, is when, when the shaft goes in there, if you don't have the nipple on, you know, there's nothing that's going to hold it centered in there. Even if you have two on there. You know, so you could try to get it in the center and clamp it down tight, but it'll still be floating in there. Sooner or later, it'll just hit a bump. It'll move to one edge, and then it'll be metal on metal rubbing. <clears throat> now, do the nipples last forever? No, but at least when you're putting it together, you're still going to get it centered. Now, this is like an air pist a piston out of an air cylinder, something like that. And the, the end looked different because it was much bigger diameter and it had a groove in it for an o-ring and stuff like that. I found it. All I wanted was the shaft so that it fits nice on there. I tried using the bolt and everything was kind of sloppy so this shaft actually fit perfect. I turned it down on the lathe so that that is the size I need here. Really really freaking close. Um, I just drilled that hole to 5 ace and turned this to 5 ace and you know they're probably off of a thou or two, but uh, that's not even perfectly round since it's a drill bit. But, uh, anywho, it is the right dimension for that. We're going to put a nipple on here so that it works correctly. I don't have to return it, and I don't have to send out, you know, this kind of half ass crap to the guys getting the arms and that stuff. Uh, I'll just have to look at that a little closer. This is another step that requires more work. All right, we're getting it set up here. Now I have my micro cut. It's a Nicole system micro cut. Uh, they're really sharp, and this is what I'm going to cut it with. Uh, urethane's a little more forgiving. You can cut it with other stuff. But... Okay, so it's not a very heavy cut. So really all I'm going to do here is I'm just going to snug the, the chuck down a little bit just to grab the shaft of hair, and then... Just tap it in a little and then finish tightening up and that's going to give it enough grip that uh, it doesn't doesn't go anywhere and if I if I get in and get too heavy a cup cut yeah it'll slip a little bit but who cares and since I moved the compound let's just go in here and I'm just gonna put the DRO on zero and then I can just dial to zero uh, this will change a bit every time so I'm just gonna touch off there and I'm gonna go in roughly 70 thou or so 80 thou looks like the other ones about uh, almost an eighth of an inch so we can go in about a hundred thou and see what it does okay I've got it set at uh, 1255 rpms <laughs> See how it uh... nice, huh? Mm. 
Nothing wrong with that. Cool. Okay, I got <laughs> got a few of these to do, so. So actually, that's one way to make some uh, rubber gaskets, huh? They're actually pretty darn flat. You know, despite just simply cutting sideways when I get to the depth there. Hmm. Makes me want to keep them, but good God, man, I got so many other... <laughs> I mean, it's, it's trash. It's going in the trash should go in the trash. Uh, I sure hope it goes in the trash. <laughs>